with you sending you sun, tons of shine at the end of our time together today you will officially be fourth graders congratulations to you all and we cannot wait to talk about the amazing things that we've accomplished together as a class this school year while we can't be together in person, we know that this is a really special time and want to make sure that we keep it special for everyone by please keep your mics muted throughout our presentation so that we don't have any kind of funny sounds that are distracting. Send all the shine. I already see you doing this, but we want to feel all the love all the way through our computers wherever we are. And we need you to stay with us till the end of the ceremony. We have fun stuff planned from beginning to end, so please stay with us. Before we begin our celebration, we want to take a minute to look back at our year together and celebrate all the achievements that we have had. Um, this is a small video with, with snapshots of our entire school and is meant to really warm your heart and celebrate all that we have done together. Mr. Knight Justice, if you will cue up the video. What an incredible video of an incredible year. Scholars, send yourself some so many special memories there. If you remember our wing parade that our kindergartners had where you all took the cool photos, our fun Thanksgiving lunch, just a few of the super fun things we have done together this founding year. Here is our agenda for our time together today. Almost the arrow at the bottom. Mm -hmm. Yep. Great. Um, so I feel that in order for us to really to celebrate today, we got to get our energy up and going. So the next thing we're going to do is Mr. Knight Justice is going to lead us through our most important cheer we have, our We Are Ethos cheer. We're then going to get to hear from our teachers, Ms. Armour Ms. and Ms. Avery are going to spend some meaningful words toward to you. We'll then have homeroom superlatives where 
each of you are going to receive an award recognizing the super special and unique contributions that you bring to your classroom and our schoolhouse every day. We'll then talk through some academic recognition for our highest step achiever, our highest map achiever, as well as our hugely important SOAR award presented by Mr. Knight Justice. We'll then talk through some culture recognition as well with our attendance, artist of the year, mission to 1 million top achievers, and true blue J scholar. We'll then close out with a fun photo of our virtual class right here before we close our time with some big celebration today. So without further ado, Mr. Knight Justice, we need to get our energy going. All right, scholars, so for this, I want everyone to bring the energy, everyone to make sure that they're being as loud as they can in their homes. Go ahead and scholars, give me a beat. We are in for students. You can be proud. You can be proud. You can be proud. We are in for students. If you can't hear me, shout a little louder. We are equal. If you can't hear me, shout a little louder. At ethos, we do the right thing. Do the right thing. Do the right thing. At ethos, we do the right thing. Do the right thing. Do the right thing. Thing. We work hard. hard. We're going to college. college. We're so smart. We're getting more knowledge. Because let me drum roll. Let me see everybody. Catherine, let me see you drum roll. I see you, Jalen, with the drum roll. I see you, Jaden, with the drum roll. I see you with the drum roll, Ava. At Ethos, we do the right thing. thing. Have a great job, Ooh. scholars. I felt that energy scholars. I felt it all the way through my computer here at Ethos. Super exciting. All right, homeroom teachers, Miss Armore and Miss Avery, we cannot wait to hear a message from you. All right, hello, Larson scholars, hello, families. Um, I wrote you all a little letter for you, so I'm gonna read it aloud. So dear Larson scholars, as you get ready to boldly move into fourth grade, I want to remind you of a mantra that I brought to you during the year. Relax, relate, release. Relax, not your standards, not your goals, but just yourself. I know that there are times where it can feel like the weight of the world is on you, but just remember to take a breath, take a step, and take it all day by day. Relate to your friends, to your family, and to your teachers. Remember that we're here to help you, connect with you, and grow with you. Never forget that we're on your side. Release. A uh, breath, you did it, you all did it. You conquered third grade year despite any obstacles that got in your way. As your teacher, I have a deep admiration for the tenacity each and every one of you have shown. Scholars, always remember how capable you are. To say that you, teaching you all was a joy is such an understatement. Sometimes there just aren't words to do a feeling justice, but if I had to choose one, I'd say honor. It has truly been my honor to have taught your third grade year. As you conquer the world, know I'll always be rooting for you. Love, Ms. Moore. <laughs> You're gonna throw the mic to Ms. Avery. Hi, Larson. I just wanna let you guys know I miss you all so much. I just love seeing all of your beautiful faces on the screen. All right, so mine's is not as long, but I wanted you to know that I was so proud to be your teacher this year in science and in foundations. You guys show true tenacity. You persevered through all of the hardest challenges and all of it was remarkable to see because I never saw any pushback, just push through. I think that's amazing and I look forward to seeing that next year as we move into our fourth grade year together. Mm -hmm. I've watched you learn and I've watched you grow. We worked so hard and we also had a lot of fun. How fast the year went by is unbelievable to me. But I know that the reason it went by so fast and the reason that we felt so much love is because we had that love and adoration for each other. We had so many special times, but now it is time for us to say goodbye just for a little while. Just know that you will always have a special place within my heart and that I love you all tremendously. Please remember that I am only a phone call, Zoom, or email away, and I look forward to seeing each of you in the fall. 
Thank you, teachers. We now have, your teachers have created a super special third grade, almost fourth grade video for you all. Ooh. Mr. Knight Justice, if you will, tune it up. to see you in action. We are now going to talk through the amazing, unique contributions that each of you have gifted to our, our, your classroom and your school. If Miss Armora, you will kick us off with our Larson Superlatives. All right, so we are gonna go ahead and begin with our superlatives. Each scholar has played a vital role in our homeroom success and culture. As founders, we have a bond that no other group of scholars could have built with us, and we are very touched to have had you all during this year. I'm so fortunate that I got to meet each and every one of you and your families. So superlatives are awards given based on the individual contributions, talents, and joy that you brought to our space. We can count on you to be your amazing self, and I'd like to take the time, me and Mrs. Avery, to recognize each scholar for his or her important role in our class. All right, so first up, most dependable award. This person always follows through on a task. They do it with a smile and they never fail to get this things done. This goes to Miss Savannah Chapman. Congratulations, woo! <laughs> All 
Next up, we have our ray of sunshine. This person is always willing to offer encouragement and a smile. It goes to Charles Peterson. All right, next up, most creative. You can always catch her drawing and whatever she creates is very unique and beautiful. They have, she has the ability to make what seems impossible or hard an extraordinary masterpiece. This goes to none other than Miss Journey Perry. Congratulations. <laughs> oh wait, that was a double. I wasn't, pl I wasn't planning on doing that one. All right, this next one is for best penmanship. He has handwriting that is all-star neat and complete. This goes to Chandler Pettis. All right, next up, the biggest heart. You made our classroom community feel warm and fuzzy inside, not just our classroom, but ethos as a whole. This goes to Miss Lyric Wright. Congratulations, Lyric. You are so deserving. Next up, we have the best team player. There is no I in team. You make sure everyone feels welcome. And it goes to Brianna Thomas. All right, next up, most likely to make you smile. You kept us soul with joy and made every moment feel oh so special with your smile and your warmth. This goes to Miss Ava Hill, congratulations. Next up, we have the biggest bookworm award. It goes to Zavi Jojia. Did I pronounce that right? Your love for reading as much as possible inspires us all. All right, next up, best attitude. When you're excited, we all get excited. You bring the positivity and you ignore the negativity. You keep yourself grounded. This goes to Professor Hicks, Jaden Hicks. Congratulations. Ooh. Next up, we have our superstar student. You are an exemplary model, exemplary model of student conduct and behavior to your peers. This goes to Zion Major. All right, next up, super scientists. You are bound to uncover some major scientific dis discovery. This goes to Mr. Jalen Franklin. Next up, we have our most school spirit award. We are ethos, couldn't be prouder. You always make sure to represent us well. And it goes to Catherine Long. All right, next up, Integrity Awards. This person is most likely to do the right thing even when nobody is watching. This goes to Ms. Kenzamai Davis, congratulations. How about our best storyteller award? You make any story come alive. This goes to Joy Williams. All right, our math superstar. You tackle every math problem with tenacity and have achieved great success. This goes to Mr. Jaden Hicks. Congratulations. Next up is our most eager learner. You are happy and excited to learn. This goes to Quincy Andrews. All right, so we are moving into academic recognition now. So this year's academic awards were based on scholar achievement and growth throughout the year. The following scholars show the highest achievement and growth on the STEP assessment, which is a nationally recognized assessment that measures students' reading ability. We monitor their progress throughout the year. This, uh, this, this year's highest STEP achiever of the year is Jalen Franklin, STEP 11. Congratulations, Jalen. 
All right, and then our highest step growth of the year. So the person who grew the most levels goes to not one, but two scholars, Zabi and Catherine. Congratulations, scholars. All right, we also have scholars who grew a ton in MAP and scored super, super high on their MAP reading assessment. MAP is a nationally normed assessment where scholars take uh, problems on a, on a computer, is adaptive, so um, it adjusts to their, to their level. So for reading, the highest MAP achiever of the year is Javi, Zavi, sorry, and then the highest MAP uh, growth of the year goes to Joy Williams with 34 points. Excellent job. And then for, let's go back, for math, we also have highest map achiever for that and then highest map growth of the year. So highest achiever of the year for the map, for the math map goes to Jalen Franklin. And then highest map growth of the year for math goes to Catherine Long. And then this next award is my favorite by far. So the next award is the SOAR Award. This is awarded to a scholar who shows uh, not only the growth in the data and the achievement, but just has a certain level of, of shows tenacity when it comes to completing their assignments, raising their hand, participation, and just are just completely well-rounded when it comes to their academics. For third grade, this will go to Lyric. Right, Lick Wright, congrats. SOAR Award, which stands for Scholar of Academic Recognition. It is a huge honor to receive this. So, so proud of you, Larry, for being uh, the recipient of this award. Congratulations, Scholar. Send yourself some shine. I need to see those shining fingers. I'm looking for those shining fingers, Chandler Pettis. I see those shining fingers, Savvy. Ooh, send each other some shine. Ooh, we are now gonna move into some culture awards. So we know that in order to grow our brain, we have to be at school, we have to be on time, and we have to be ready to learn. Miss Mac, will you talk us through our perfect attendance awards? Would be happy to. So we know that last year this time as family, we talked about being at school, being on time, and all these things to get ready for the upcoming school year. So I am so honored to celebrate um, not only the scholar, but the family who took it so seriously that they have a near perfect attendance record. And that scholar is, drum roll, doo -doo -doo. still drum rolling, still rolling, keep going, a little harder burns. A little, there we go, there we go. Jaden Hicks, woo! Congratulations. Huge congratulations, Jaden. We're next gonna know, talk about our artist of the year. And we know as a classical school, we focus on reading, we focus on writing, and we focus on becoming true blue artists. Miss McDonald, who is our artist of the year? Our artist of the year is a student who has displayed our core true blue values. They have come to art eager to learn and they have really used art as an outlet of expression for themselves. This student may have come a little bit late in the year, but when she came to art, she brought it all the way. And that is Miss Ava Hill is our artist of the year. Way to go, Ava. Congratulations, Ava, super exciting. I am now so excited to learn about our Mission to One Million Top Achiever. Our Top Achiever is gonna be awarded by Ms. Keck, who is the Top Achiever on our whole team of teachers. She has beat us all. Ms. Keck, who is our Mission to One Million Top Achiever? I am super excited to announce our Mission to One Million Top Achiever. If we can get a drum roll, please. Our mission to one million top achiever is just keep that drum roll. We're gonna get it. Ooh. Catherine Long. Woo! Congrats, Catherine. Oh, Catherine. Amazing. And 
our true Blue Jay Scholar of the Year is going to be presented by Miss Gambrell. Miss Gambrell, can you tell us what it means to be the true Blue Jay Scholar of the Year? Yes, I've been waiting for this. Before I tell you guys, I want to recite the Ethos Creed. We did this in third grade back in the fall. Um, I just want to ground you guys in what it means to be a true Blue Scholar first. I am a true blue scholar on the path to success. I start each day with my mind focused on doing my best. I have tenacity, respect, urgency, and eagerness. I can achieve anything. I'm a vital part of my community. I find joy in my work and power in my words. I believe in myself, my school, and my family. I never give up, lower my standards, or cause harm. I love, I lead, I learn, I focus. Yesterday's challenges are behind me. Success is measured by what happens today. And the True Blue Jay Scholar um, of the Year really embodies that creed. Um, they also scored super high on kickboard by showing consistency all year. And that scholar is, drum roll. Who's it gonna be? Who's it gonna be? Jaden Hicks. Way to go, Jaden. Amazing, Jaden. We're so proud of you. Thank you for being our true Blue Jay Scholar of the Year and for making our school such a special place. Scholars, congratulations to each and every one of you for a remarkable, truly extraordinary founding year. Congratulations. As of this moment, you are officially fourth graders. Give yourself some celebration. You all have done the hard work and grown your brains. We cannot wait to see you in August. We have a special closing out of the celebration on Monday from 7.45 until 5 p.m. Families, you can come by and pick up your scholar certificate, any trophies if they got Artist of the Year, the SOAR Award, or the True Blue Jay Award, as well as Perfect of Attendance. Um, we also have our teachers have made you all a customized 2020 treat for you to pick up and families you've got a treat as well so please come and celebrate closing out by getting your uh, certificates and trophies as well as we have a fun photo booth so you can really capture the last few days of third grade before we go into fourth grade um, we are so proud of you scholars we are ethos couldn't be prouder and couldn't be prouder of each of you um, before we close out miss mcdonald is going to take one final virtual class picture for us miss mcdonald tell us what you need all right i need Parents, students, staff, everybody, make sure you are in your camera frame. Make sure your good side is showing those pearly whites. And we are going to say ethos. One, two, three. We're going to take one more happy faces and in the frame. Oh, you guys are beautiful. We have the most beautiful school ever. Uh, amazing. Scholars, congratulations. You've done it. We cannot wait to see you on Monday to pick up your awards. Oh, good job. Go Congratulations. Congratulations. Congrats. So proud of you.